Hi, I'm Noelle Nielsen, and I'm here today with one of my teammates and partner, Blake Suddeth, with an episode of The Hungry Minnesotan. We are at Mallard's restaurant in Invergrove Heights. This isn't the episode we planned, but this is the one we're gonna do. This is my dad in my family's restaurant. This is David Suddeth, and um, he has some big plans. Uh, he wants to help, and he's gonna tell you a little bit about of what's going on right now. Awesome, thanks Blake. Uh, I know that you called me a couple days ago and said, hey, what's going on, how can I help? And we're all going through something that's uh, we've never been through before. And it's a challenge for everybody. And um, I know that a lot of people are out there doing some, some good things and helping the community. And I was looking on the internet, saw that uh, a, a restaurant in Kentucky was feeding all the restaurant families that are out of jobs. And I thought, wow, <laughs> That's something that's really needed, and how can uh, how can we partner? How can you help me uh, make that happen? So um, that's kind of why we're here, and what we're what we're trying to do is figure out a way to to feed all the the restaurant and and bar and service industry people that don't have jobs for the next week uh, week or two, and uh, they need food uh, for their families. So. Absolutely. So who can get fed? So obviously. Uh, restaurants in general, um, all, all over Minnesota and Wisconsin now are, are closed for dine-in, but we are open for takeout. But what we're doing for the restaurant family members, um, any restaurant or bar uh, employee uh, can come in between four and seven and uh, show a paycheck stub or, or show some identification that you work at a restaurant and you are gonna get a meal to take home for your family. Um, every day, we're gonna be open every day until this is done. Uh, so that's the plan. Uh, we're hoping that this grows so we can have several locations across the metro that are Absolutely. feeding uh, restaurant workers and their families, and that's the, that's the goal. When the news came down the pipe that restaurants were going to be shut down, my heart sank yep. because my thoughts immediately went to you guys, all the employees that you have, and then I started thinking, there are so many employees out there that they don't know when they're going to be on the schedule and if it's just one thing you know a meal that they you know that is comped for the night right um, i know that goes a long way you know there's a lot of fear there's a lot of anxiety right now how long is this going to last what's going on and and um, i think the message that that we want to make sure is out there that, that hey that there's hope you know we can get through this the restaurant the the, the service industry uh, the people that that help serve all of us you guys out there are so resilient and you're so um, passionate about what you do that um, there's a lot of hope in that. And I know that if this lasts a couple of days or, or two weeks or three weeks that we're gonna make it through and we're gonna come out stronger. But in the meantime, what do we do? Yeah. And so I think, uh, you know, we've had, a, I can't do this alone and we've had a couple of sponsors come by and, um, and offered to help a little bit with, uh, some donations and uh, we're gonna uh, feed as many people as we can. So we're opening our doors uh, for every restaurant worker, not just people that work for yeah. us. Every, yeah. anybody that works in the restaurant industry um, or coffee shop or, or a bar, if you're, if you're part of that uh, restaurant industry, then come in and um, you get a family meal to take home to your family. So. Absolutely. And if you're not a part of that industry, you still yes. can order takeout and support your local restaurants and support your local coffee shops and bars. So get your orders in, go do takeout, keep supporting them, help keep them alive. And if you wanna get behind this mission and uh, get on the same page that we're all on, click in the link that we have in this description and you can donate and support this cause as well.